A police operation in central Kingston this morning may have cracked a major petrol stealing ring. The thieves have been targeting Jamaica Urban Transit Company JUTC buses. Now, as you'll hear in this report, among those arrested is an employee of the bus company. It appears to be a well-organized operation. Pumps, hoses, fuel boxes, and a hole carved into the gas tank of a JUTC bus. It's what officers of the Kingston Central Police Division say they came upon during an operation minutes after 10 o'clock Tuesday morning. The cops say they confronted a group of men who were seen removing petrol from this 31A JUTC bus. The bus, which runs between Chancery Street and the city via Marcus Garvey Drive, was parked at the intersection of Marlborough Avenue and Wagonet Crescent in the division. In addition to the tools found at the scene, more jars, seemingly ready to be filled with fuel from the bus, were found at this house nearby. The cops say the four men, including the driver of the bus, who were caught in the act, were subsequently taken into custody. This is the most recent incident of fuel theft from the JUTC. The illicit activity costs the company billions each year. While representatives of the JUTC declined to comment on Tuesday's arrests, this was the entity's managing director, Paul Abrams, at Parliament's Public Administration and Appropriations Committee in July. We have tried always to try and quantify filfrage, um, but it's eluded us. And that's the truth, because um, you run an operation that's 24 hours a day, seven days a week, 365 days a year. So we'll through three o'clock in the mornings, activities can possibly take place. He admitted that the situation is further complicated by possible collusion with workers. The four persons taken into custody are expected to be charged. Kalisha Williams, TVJ News.